Hey Taurus, welcome to Soul Therapy 1111. This is your reading. Let's see what's coming up for you, what you need to know. This could be sun, moon, or rising, or your Venus, or the person that you're dealing with as well, because I know you guys like to read, like to listen to your person's reading as, as well. Spirit, what do we have for Taurus? What do they need to know? What does Taurus need to know? Okay, Taurus, I'm get oh, I'm getting a lot of regret. You have regretted something you have said, is what I've got. There's a lot of regret about something you have said or said to somebody. This could also be some something that somebody said to you and they are regretting it, but I'm picking up that I don't know what this is. This could this could be family, this could be a relationship, work situation. You said some things that now you're like, oh, God, did I say that? I don't really mean to say that. That kind of energy. Can you just put me on a boat and fly? Just take me somewhere else. And you're like, Ugh. what Spirit's kind of saying is, don't worry about this too much. Just chill. You know, it is what it is. Stop being so hard on yourself because you're being very, very hard on yourself. Is what I'm getting. Very hard working as well. You've been working a little bit too much. Okay and you need to rest and take a bit of a rest is what i'm getting um there could be potential of growth here when it comes to business okay or work or anything to do with money so if you are focusing on a new job or new career new or even if it's not new there is definitely going to be an upgrade here when it comes to your finances or your work or your career um there's going to be a new idea somehow um, this could be, this could spark up from that conversation you had that you said stuff that you weren't supposed to kind of say, maybe you asked for a raise or maybe you said something stupid to your boss or a coworker. Do you know what I mean? But it looks like it's going to be okay. That's why spirits kind of like, just relax. Um, there is a potential of, like I said, an upgrade of some sort here when it comes to money and career. Okay, surprise, surprise. We got somebody here. <laughs> somebody wants to take a risk here when it comes to you. This could be somebody at work, could be a work colleague, but this could also be somebody from your past or somebody that you just share some sort of emotional bond or, or connection with. I feel that this person wants to express how they feel about you, but they're afraid to take a risk. Now, they're afraid because I feel that you are a very strong, independent nobody fucks around with me kind of that you know this kind of attitude you know um that's the energy i'm picking up and maybe this is the person you had words with they've got a lot of emotions but they're afraid to take a risk i don't know if you guys dated in the past i don't know if they tried to date you and you kind of rejected this person and they're a bit like i don't know if i should say something okay but there definitely there is definitely somebody here could be at your workplace that has an interest in you but what i'm getting from you is you're just not <laughs> i'm sorry i gotta say it they're too good for you you're not dealing with that you want a little bit of red flags going on you want a little bit of spice <laughs> i've got that nah they're too easy i don't want that i want a little bit of toxic okay you want a little bit of toxic listen they're not going to be for everybody but you need a little bit of I feel that you've been working so hard and you've been so focused on yourself and so, you know, <laughs> so busy that you, you want a bit of a fuckboy. I'm not going to lie. You know, you don't want anything serious. I, I'm not getting, of course, this is not going to be for all of you, but there is a sense that you just want to be free and have a bit of fun, you know? And this other person that kind of wants to come in and say something, you ain't going to want them because they, 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 they have green flags and you're looking for a little bit of a red shade, you know, you like a little bit of spice. You want a little bit of spice. Just be careful if it's too hot. I know you guys like food and shit like that, apparently. I'm a Taurus rising, so I can say that. And who the fuck doesn't like food anyway? Right, what else does Taurus need to know? What is that? Ooh. Gonna make some decisions, or you need to make a decision. You don't want to make this decision. Oh no! You, you're just you're just letting it go. You've got a couple of weeks left until you make this decision. Is what I've got. Okay. 
and this decision is to unclutter your life okay this could be your house your business your wardrobe just get rid of shit that you don't need anymore is is a very strong one here get rid of stuff that you don't need because i feel there's a big change coming towards you guys financially okay financially again we've got that little boy in the corner wanting to come in but you're not having any of it mm -mm. you don't want that you are all about loving yourself it's all about you getting your money going out having fun wanting a little bit of that toxic kind of energy because you can deal with it you know what i mean you know you made the flag yourself so you know how to deal with it um try not to get too caught up in your um in your head i've got you guys really worried about work a lot don't worry about work okay um i'm honestly getting that everything's going to be okay when it comes to work but you do have something here that is still very much in your head and i do feel that it was something you said or an argument you had or there was some sort of conversation here that is still playing up in your head and you're like oh i don't know what to do just leave it just leave it and go get that red flag that you want you gotta be okay with that anyway let's see when it comes to love because they didn't, they didn't really mention much about love let's see taurus what do they need to know spirit anything else for taurus Ooh, you're strong you are strong your emotions are strong you have controlled your emotions you know how to deal with that we got multiple options Oh, you are the ruler, aren't you? <laughs> you are done messing about, aren't you? You are done. I've got you guys here done with relationships. Who's coming next is what I'm getting. Who's coming next? Not necessarily in that, but listen, you're not, you're not, you're not dealing with relationships. Mm -mm. Possibly not in the next couple of months. You just want to see what you can get. You're all about the work at the moment, focusing on yourself, building yourself up, which you are going to do. And whoever comes along, let them come along. Let them come along, but they ain't going to get no little princess. They're going to get this queen of swords. You're, gonna, you're ready with that sword. So I don't see a relationship, but not because <laughs> there'll be a relationship if you want a relationship. But spirit's like, mm -mm, that bitch don't want anything right now. So we're just going to leave her to it. Leave her to it is, is what I'm getting. Okay, let's see the guidance for Taurus. Okay, guidance. Guidance for Taurus spirit. It's all about you. No more sacrificing. You are in power. You know what I mean? It's all about you. I do what I want when I want, and that's it. Like I said, Taurus, like that. That's your energy at the moment. I don't care about the obstacles. I don't care about the challenges because I'm a fly through it. I'm a fly through it. And I've got the patience of a saint. What you do? okay but spirit is kind of warning you be careful with these temptations i know you like the red flags okay don't lie you like a bit, bit of spice but go careful okay go careful you don't want to get burned you do not want to get burned especially if you're dealing with any of the fire signs because i've done the fire sign readings just go careful spiritual strength you are very very strong even spiritually some of you might be going through a spiritual awakening or a leveling up there are different types of i'm not going to go into that uh, but you are definitely transforming is what i've got again materialistic spiritual growth movement choices decisions whatever to be honest with you taurus what i'm guessing is whatever effing decision you make it gonna work out gonna work out gonna work out to be fair good reading good reading good reading be honest with yourself is also what i'm getting be honest with yourself do you really just want to fuck around and find out or do you want a committed relationship and are you just using work to run away from that i didn't say that spirit did just saying something to think about taurus okay so yeah that was your reading if you haven't subscribed yet mm -hmm, subscribe and i will see you in the next reading bye